Hey there, welcome to or welcome back to No Pants Profits. My name's Richard, coming to you today from right after the pajama party on the Virgin Cruise, Virgin Voyages Scarlet Lady. And I've got my uh, late night, uh, straight of the course, unique beer to have here. And we're going to talk about the latest addition to the Sweater Ventures Venture Capital Fund. As soon as I pour my beer here, got some beer, got some eggs, got some bacon. Well, the best way to get looking at true footage. Bacon's nice and crispy. Let's get looking at true footage, which is the latest um, venture capital uh, at venture capital addition to the Sweater Ventures Fund. So true footage came out on uh, November 2nd, 2022. It's the morning of November 3rd. Had all my camera tech packed up and ready to go. So let's go ahead, let's take a look at it. Now, what does True Footage do? True Footage is a tech-enabled appraisal company for both in-person and desktop appraisals. So I want to give you some background because I, I think I can add a little bit of color to this. I will tell you personally, uh, there was a point in my past that I actually worked for a company that did both in-person and desktop meaning on your computer at home, did roofing software. So you can actually measure roofs remotely. So I do have a bit of a background in the appraisal industry, especially for roof repairs and insurance repairs. This is more along talking about selling houses, but I want to dig into this. Uh, Sweater thinks it's a good investment. I really haven't disagreed with any of Sweater's investments uh, other than sh Shippy. I, I really have some legal questions still about, about uh, Shappy. Uh, but let's go ahead, let's look at true footage. You can see that they have grown 15 times. So the revenue has grown, not apple juice, the revenue has grown 15 times year over year, and they're in operation already in 32 states. So we're gonna dig into those 32 states that are in operation. Then there's the prop tech, which is literally something I haven't heard of before, but I guess that's property tech operating in 32 states. It's already the largest appraisal company in the United States, the largest single appraisal company in the United States. We're gonna see if we can dig a bit into the tech crunch and see how many people have already invested there. We're gonna take a look at the website in a minute. They have LinkedIn. They don't seem to have a YouTube or a Facebook or anything like that I already dug, but let's dig a little deeper. Faster, faster, fairer, breath, better appraisals. True Footage is a residential appraisal company founded in 2019 and launched in 2021. So it's new, it's a baby. Um, their core business is a tech-enabled appraisal company for both in-person and desktop appraisals, meaning remote appraisals from a computer. They also have a software platform that improves the efficiency and objectivity of the appraisal process. Currently, they're operating in 32 states, including Florida, where I'm right outside of. I'm headed to Key West right now. Um, providing appraisals uh, to over 300 banks and appraisal management companies as customers. The appraisal industry remains one of the most manual steps in the residential home ownership cycle. Yeah, I mean, I'm a SoFi user myself. I can literally go on the SoFi app whenever I want, 24 hours a day, and get my rate. Now, I'll tell you right now, rates are about 7%. So rates are not cheap right now, but you, you, you can actually go on and get your rates right now. So rates are a thing, rates do exist. Um, but you know, appraisals are still the most manual process of buying a house. So it is the most manual steps in residential homeownership during the C word, the labor shortage in the appraisal industry, as well as surging refinance demand, because everyone wanted to get that 2% sweet, 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 2% is almost free money. Right now, we're at 7% in November of 2022. We're at 7%, 2% free money compared to that, you know, they wanted to get that sweet, sweet appraisal money uh, to get that in so they can refinance and do other things with that. Um, but a lot of these appraisal companies have low quality customer service. Uh, I will tell you, we had to sell my grandmother's house about a year ago and uh, we actually got a good appraiser. But there's a lot of appraisers out there that are kind of little sketch. So, you know, the idea is, you know, you have low quality customer service, even as the market has cooled, again, Sweater is recognizing that the market has cooled. So even as the market has cooled, uh, millions of appraisers are needed every year for mortgage providers and non-lender valuations. Let's say you get a divorce. You gotta know what the house is worth when you get a divorce. When in the state, when someone dies, you gotta do that. If you wanna challenge what the, what the state or the city is charging you in property taxes, 
you, you got to have an appraisal to do that, uh, and et cetera. Appraisers are looking to join a platform with more services and benefits. The failures of the appraising industry during the C word, the illness, uh, created an opening for new market participants to capture market share. Yeah, this 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 really got surged in the C word. They're the leading appraisal modernization movement with its appraisal platform and its software products. Why Sweater invested? They 15 times their annual revenue in the past year, even with, key word, even with a rising interest rate environment. So I think that's very, very, very important. Uh, and they offer an average turnaround of six days. The industry average is three times more that. Reducing snags and closing new loans, 27% of delayed home transactions had appraisal issues. So right now, you know, you're seeing more and more home buys canceled because the rates are going up. The quicker you can get appraisal done, the quicker you can close a deal. The quicker you can close a deal, the quicker you can lock in the rates. And, you know, everybody smiles. Well, unless you're a cash buyer or, you know, you're waiting for the market to collapse like I am. Um, they, they use appraisal software to draw real market data for their appraising. The industry is ripe for innovation. Yeah, it's, it's a good old boys industry. It's people that have been around for so many years. Uh, you know, more than half appraisals are over 60. They're not, uh, they're not smartphone users. They're not digital camera users or anything like that. You know, they're, when more than half of the appraisers are over 60, it is a ripe industry for innovation. They put the pressure on methods to more efficiently conduct appraisals as these older appraisers attire, retire at 65, 70 years old. Regular state challenges as well as new product lines from lenders create a demand for new types of appraisal companies with faster turnaround times. And they have a strong founder fit as well. John Liss, who's the founder of this company, uh, <laughs> forgetting the name, <laughs> True Footage. Uh, John Liss, who's the founder of the company, uh, is passionate about real estate his entire life. He owned his real estate license at 18, later conducted his thesis on real estate and brokerages while attending Harvard, hey, big name, and then Harvard Business School, hey, big name. Uh, prior work experience in the financial markets, they have over 200 appraisers and apprentices and over 300 banking partners. So we're going to go ahead, let's take a look at their website now so we can kind of investigate what's going on there. Uh, so this is Fairer, Faster, Better Appraisals, empowering professionals to do what they do best. Let's take a look at the, what they say they do best. You are about to witness the very exciting story. There is a renaissance, a, a rebirth today of which we are a part. It is the task of every generation to build a road for the next generation. And this housing project, I believe, can provide a better life for the people who come after us. To buy and rent houses without the basis of race. Every American having the right and a chance to own a home, it is in our national interest. that more people own their own home. Before. It kind of looks like a Matterport like uh, clone, uh, if, you, if you know anything about Matterport, kind of looks like a Matterport clone for appraisers, you know, specifically instead of for realtors, because Matter Matterport is for taking pretty pictures that you can then put on the real estate sites, the Zillow, give your 3D tours, give everything like that. This is like that, but for appraisers. So it's kind of an interesting concept there overall. So laser focus on going the extra mile for customers, 98% on time delivery. 43 hours inspection to release, 3,000 plus years accumulated experience. Eh. They said six days, 5.41, so even sweater rounded up there. Uh, they do all types of valuation work, purchases, refinances, home equity, non-lender, so tax challenges, divorce, other things like that, property data report. And they're already in a lot of states. If you see those dark green states, they're there. 32 states and coming to the rest of the states in 2022 and 2023. So. 
Essentially, what it seems to be is it is a platform kind of like a Matterport. If you know anything about Matterport, it's a platform kind of like Matterport, uh, which is used for you know selling in real estate, uh, for doing a more inclusive industry forward. We're true footage. Work with us uh, so we can take a look. Let's take a look at Spark. Spark for appraiser seems to be something they own. Let's see what's going on there. Try Spark for free. Yeah, so it is a new adjustment. Ah, it's for adjusters. Okay. So work less. Click on the categories below. Trend analysis, data employer. Why Spark? Spark imports the data for you. Data importing, MLS and public records. So yeah, this is really kind of a real estate app between preferred data source, save your preferences and future reports. So it shows you trend analysis. This is a tool that's actually made by True Footage here. So site value tool, you have a digital work file. So they're, they're really focusing on, this is kind of like the sales force of the appraiser world. I think that's really what they're focusing on is, you know, can they be the sales force of the appraiser world? And, you know, maybe they can be. And if I go to join us, let's just take a look at their join us page. Let's see what's going on here. True footage provides long-term growth and opportunity for new entrants into the industry. While also... We'll leave that for a second, but I think what they're probably trying to do is they're trying to, to pitch people... To keeping the existing appraisers in the game and in the business. There are ideas here that I haven't even thought of kind of talking about the appraisal side and trying to get people, takes an entire company, get uh, that's talking about actually joining the company, talent isn't bound to one place. So you can look at current job openings. Again, we always like to look at current job openings because if they have a lot of job openings, that means the company is growing, which is great. You see they have appraisers in Cincinnati, Des Moines, Iowa, Indianapolis, Illinois, Jacksonville, Florida, Las Vegas, Nevada, Miami, Florida, which is where I am, South Florida, Orlando, San Antonio, Santa Fe, Washington, everything like that so it actually looks quite good and if I want to join their appraisal team I just want to see if that's a little bit different yep so that is joining their actual appraisal team so this is not I want to be very clear this does not seem to be a company that's like a um, yet like an uber or anything like that where you're actually kind of joining as an independent contractor you would actually be joining this as an employee but here's what it's doing it's taking an old industry and it's taking that old industry and it's turning it on its head it's taking something that over 50% of that industry is over 60 years old. I'm sorry if you're watching this and you're over 60 years old. I don't want to insult you, but over 60 years old is kind of a dinosaur in this day and age, especially when it comes to technology. My dad personally uses a, an iPhone that's many, 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 many years old and says, there's nothing wrong with my iPhone. You know, he's one of those that's like, there's nothing wrong with my iPhone. But that's the main logic there. It is you know, taking an industry that's ripe for innovation and it is innovating. I love kind of just what Sweater's doing uh, and Sweater is right now, I think I could disclose this because we said enough, you know, they're looking to raise money to actually have the Sweater platform to own a point of this pl Sweater platform because Sweater's allowing normal people to invest in venture capital. So it's really kind of cool. It's disrupting the industry and I like this because true, uh, true footage is really disrupting the industry here grown five times it's an industry that's right for retirement over half the people are going to retire in the next few years well who knows with inflation and things that way but over half the people should retire at 65 in the next five years and this tech uh the way this is working and again right now they you do have employees of true footage and it's not kind of a contractor program like it should be but i think you know if, if they know what's right for them it'll be headed there in the future this is richard from no pants profits coming to you from the Virgin Voyages Scarlet Lady on the way to Key West, reminding you that when you wear no pants and you just wear a bathrobe with no, nothing underneath, I like to say all you got to lose is your shirt, but I guess in this scenario, all you got to lose is your bathrobe. Have a good one. Bye.